All right. We can see Drake's red guitar in the background there. This is Drake's video. And we are going to, we're kind of working on this Never Say Never song, which includes these chords, which I gave you Drake on that one right there. Whoops. Those are the four chords. And they look like this when I play them and should look like that when you play them. That's a D. And we play the notes one at a time to make sure we get them clean. And the only one we can't really play on a D chord is this sixth string here. Doesn't really fit. You can wrap your thumb over and do it like that if you want. But for right now, let's just play it like this. And let's play either four or five strings. All right, hitting them all one at a time so we can hear the clean. Then it's an E minor chord. One at a time, and then a G. And then the A chord. And on that one, you can play the sixth string open if you want. It is in the A chord, so you can play it, but generally it's started from the tonic here in the, the A. So, you want to practice those and you can strum. You got a good pick grip. I like your pick grip. I got nothing to say about it. That looks good. And then, what we were talking about they do in this song, they do a uh, Travis pick, which is thumb down on the fourth string. Let's put a D chord on for fun here. Uh, thumb down on the fourth string up on the second string and I put it in tablature there too for you up on the second down on the thumb on the fourth string up on the second string with the index finger and then down with the thumb on the third string and up with the middle finger now okay so it sounds like this and you were doing it a lot faster than this so you know but I don't want you to just go like this and then stop. I want you to roll it, as I call it, so you play it continuously. You would play. All right. And I think that's going to be Good. What else did I talk about? We talked about tablature. Can I explain to you how to read tablature? You have any questions on tablature? No. Okay. And I want you to practice this spider. That will wake up all your fingers, okay? And you can practice that not just on that first string. You can practice it on all six strings, okay? From zero up to the fourth fret with the fourth finger, then back down. That one, this really gets your fingers going good, you know? This is still to this day what I warm up with before a gig because it wakes my fingers up. Zero, one, two, three, four, three, two, one, on all the strings. And uh, I think that's it. You got your chord charts there, you need to practice those chord charts. I think that's it. All right, practice hard.